Well, we have finally gotten some good snows. Um, a couple of big storms up in the mountains, so we are going to get out for our first ride of the season tomorrow. Uh, I've got a couple sleds already in the trailer, um, but I'm going to go ahead and swap around one of them. Uh, I'll still take three, just because one's brand new. We've never ridden it, so just want to have a backup in case something weird goes on. But otherwise, we'll uh, get this last sled loaded up, get our gas cans, all that, ready to go fill, and uh, get all packed up and ready to go for tomorrow morning. So we've got both our sleds in here loaded up, gas cans. Kind of got everything ready to go. And then got our third sled, uh, my kind of usual sled, here in the truck. So we are all set. Uh get out of here. I will uh, load all the bags and stuff tonight at the house and we'll be all ready to rock and roll tomorrow morning and just kind of head out. Got a little bit of snow here but uh looking forward to a whole lot more snow up there. Good morning it's 6 43 and we're headed out to the snowy range is usually where we snowmobile which is up in Wyoming and we're in Colorado so we have a little bit of a drive but how excited are you? Real excited. Gonna go sliding in some snow. Well, we made it to Wyoming. We're filling up the gas tank. Say hi. Hello. <laughs> we are not the only ones out here today, for sure. Lots of others. Well, we made it to Albany. Um, it's a pretty busy day, kind of first solid day of the season just because of the snowpack in both Colorado and Wyoming, slow start, and avalanche danger it has been pretty high recently with all the recent snowfall. So we are gonna get the trailer unloaded and head out. Our getting ready area inside the trailer. Chris put on his clothes. Can barely stand up, but it's certainly nice to be in the warmth when it's windy and cold outside. <laughs> enough to head out and hit the trail for a bit. We'll check in at some point, um, show you the snow, do some riding, show some drone shots too. It's a really pretty day. It's snowing, but it's actually quite warm for winter. So it should be a good day. is already stuck kind of behind a tree right now but it's deep in some spots and not so much in others and so he got stuck going uphill what do you have to say for yourself it's real deep it's deep in some and not so much in others but chris's motto of snowmobiling is how many times can we get stuck so here he is, stuck within the first hour. We got unstuck. Yeah. I made myself a little trench to hang out in. <laughs> yeah, it's up to your waist. It's definitely deep today. Yeah, in pockets. Uh, yeah, so I'll pick more speed on my lines. Yeah. Or less steep.
made it. I don't know it's sweat, I was snow, I was tears. <laughs> I was here for moral support. He's tired. But we got it out. Got it out, ready to ride. And I'm a certified camera person at this point. Well, we made it back. How was first day? It's good. Yeah. yeah. What was your favorite part? Getting stuck? Yeah, getting stuck. Yeah. That's always you're in deep snow. Part. Yeah. It was a good day. Yeah. Here's to many more of the season. Yeah, day one complete. Back. Yeah, made it. Good day. What's your yeah. favorite part? The fluffy snow in the untracked field. The fluffy snow. Yeah, fluffy snow is good stuff. Yeah, we found a field with no tracks, and that was awesome to ride around in because usually you find small ones, but this was pretty big, so super fun. Yeah, nice big area. Just play around, got stuck, uh, lost some gloves, but found them. And zipped my tunnel bag, so that was wide open, and we were riding around. Thankfully, it was just gloves that got lost, and then we found them. So, worked out. Yeah. Yeah. Got some sore muscles. Yeah, we're gonna be hurting tomorrow. That's okay. But a great start to the season. Yeah. Yeah, looking forward to it. I'm sure, we'll take you along at least one other point in the season. So be on the lookout for that. Yeah. Until then, catch you later. See you later.